Hello everyone, and welcome to another Fallout 76 fast play video. I am of course your host, CarrotBoy3000, and today we are going to try and play a, a little mission we got going on here, and a little, uh, you know, go through the data on our Pip-Boy and then disappear completely. Um, uh, today is of course still uh, Saturday, September 17th. It is still Elvira's birthday. It's part of the reason why I'm back is just because we needed to celebrate Elvira's birthday twice. Um, for those of you who don't know who Elvira is or for those of you who are not practicing, uh, begin practicing. <laughs> she she deserves, uh, she deserves all the celebration in the world. Anyway, let's get into this. We are going to check out our Pip-Boy and we're going to go to the data section. So we have Bureau of Tourism. Tune into WGRF uh, Grafton Radio. Um, then we have new arrivals. I'm picking up a radio transmission, another one from the Overseer. I should tune in to the Pip Boy to listen. Oh, we can continue the Overseer like that. I think that might be where we can go next. Miscellaneous. Uh, oh, oh, I'm sorry. Miscellaneous. Tune into the top of the world signal. That's the, uh, uh, what do you call it? The robot is there, the, the handy robot. Wayward Souls. Oh, this is a uh, woman has described, uh, has directed me to the Wayward, a recently set up. This is uh, uh, Wastelanders. And then the Missing Link, which is where we are uh, in the main story. I need to find out what happened to uh, Madigan as his mission was critical to dealing with the Scorched. I should check out the last known location, the top of the world. Uh, which is where we're going anyway. I don't think we're going to go to the top of the world right now. I think we are going to do um, new arrivals. So let's get rid of the missing link. I'm picking up a radio transmission from the Overseer. I should tune into my Pip Boy to listen. All right, let's go. Overseer's broadcast. All right. We need to locate the Overseer's broadcast. Okay. Um, let's fast travel someplace, I feel. Then again, one of my favorite things to do in this game is just walk. So let's, um, let's walk our little legs, uh, over here. You know what? If we don't get that radio signal, I want to claim, uh, a workbench. And I, I think I want to claim this one. This one's always been my favorite. If we don't, we don't. Or maybe we could just get there. But this is where we're going to go for today. And this is something that I used to just do in Fallout 76. Again, this was kind of the fun of Fallout 76 to me, was that I really did feel like I was in this virtual world. It felt very immersive to me. Again, I talk about this in my Yes, I Love Vanilla Fallout 76 video. There's something really immersive about this game in terms of feeling like you're in a real apocalypse. And part of that was just, you know, walking. And I was like, you know, I, I just kind of like walking in this game and discovering stuff. Uh, it really is a beautiful world. All right, we did find a signal, but that's not the overseer signal. Oh, 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 oh. Didn't get me. Didn't get me, you fool. I always uh, trip out that the jump button is on the triangle instead of the X. And this is kind of the big thing about, like, um, Bethesda Fallout games is, you know, you're meant to just explore. You're meant to kind of walk around and see what you run into, you know? So, like, this little location here that we're coming up on. This could be an interesting location. Oh. Assaultron. Again, excuse my sniffles. I'm still dealing with the sickness. I am down with the sickness, so. Is this, so it's like, is this worth clearing out? Is this worth exploring? And then how long does it take to get to that, you know, that marker on the map? Ooh, there's a... A scorched with a code somewhere around here. So again, if you're new to Fallout 76, uh, this is what the scorched turn into. These kind of frozen, petrified corpses. They give you some radiation when they do that. I think that's such a cool little piece of world building. I think it's very... When I first... Oh. So somebody else killed this person. Okay. So we... Again, this is what's kind of cool about Fallout 76 to me. Is... Okay. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. It's over. All right. We we. I am not ready for that fight. Clearly. We got to find more. Uh... Got 
gotta keep going, gotta keep going. I'm not taking that on. Did you see how much they deleted my health? We're so weak and puny right now. Crazy. We gotta work on that. That's something that we absolutely have to work on. I believe this is a... Uh, I don't know exactly what they're called. I think they're Blood Eagles. I believe this is a Blood Eagle... Uh, what's it called? Um, I forget what they're called. I believe this is a Blood Eagle location, which is a, a Wastelanders location. You know, I, I did. I, I kind of liked the idea that there were, you know, only... I don't know. Oh, no, this is a workshop. We could just clean this one. And I recognize this one, too, even though I just misidentified it. But um, this is typically the one that has a lot of dogs or rad roaches. So let's take this today. Again, this is this claiming workshops is a big part of what I like to do in this game. Um, I'm going to blow my nose really quickly. Please excuse me. <laughs> Thank you for your patience. I don't know. This is just like, I, it's just something simple and fun to do that like puts a little bit of combat in my face. And uh, I like it. I like it. And uh, so let's see if this is, uh, sometimes these can be uh, frustrating. Sometimes they can be cool. I don't know if I necessarily want to build anything here today. Oh, and you know what else? I just remembered, again, excuse me for just starting out again with Fallout 76. But uh, the scoreboard... We still don't have any score uh, yet. But let's take a look at our daily challenges. Hack a terminal. Oh, that's for uh, Fallout First members. Um, complete a daily challenge. Okay. Level up. We're about to level up. Uh, collect 100 caps. Okay. Um, and then this resets in 30 minutes, though. Hmm. Complete a daily operation. We're not going to be doing that. Complete an event. I still haven't played a daily operation. Or an operation. Cook a meal with plants or fungi. We can do that. Craft ammo at a workbench. Kill a mole miner. We can do all of that. And that's 10 mole miners. We, we can almost certainly do that stuff. So let's... Um... Let's look around here, why don't we? Do we have an ammo crafting bench? Where's the title? There we go. Tinkerers, there we go. We're not making this place pretty, you know, we're just uh We're just existing overnight. Oh, can I not do it here? Alright, then I guess we're just gonna Put it right here. We're gonna craft some ammo. Um, let's do, I mean, more shotgun ammo, right? You know what? Let's do it. There we go, and we only needed to do one. So we got a little bit of score. I think. No, we might need more. Yeah, we, we need a little bit more. So that's 24, I think. Uh, let's do... What is my... What is my... Handgun? 10 millimeter? All right, let's do 10 millimeter. And it's also just super relaxing, in my opinion, to just kind of, like, play like this. Like, there we go. We got some score. Let's let's do this. And we might have unlocked... No, we have nowhere near enough to unlock that first one. But we're, you know, we're, we're close to the first way there, right? Scoreboard. Challenges. Kill mole miners. Maybe we'll do that today. Who knows? I mean, if we have enough time. We'll definitely level up. We'll definitely complete an event. So that's two of the the that's three of the five that we need to do. Collect a hundred caps. We might do that. We might earn a hundred caps. So we're looking in good standing. 
as long as we do the five that that's what was confusing me as long as we do five daily challenges we'll get that gold star challenge which is which is very coveted you know sought after but first we have to survive this get ready everybody now i typically oh it's three waves of robots boo okay I wonder if I have enough. I typically don't like doing the um, the turrets because I want the XP for myself. But at this level... And also, like, sometimes they're hard to find. At this level and to seek them out, um, I'll put up a couple turrets. Again, not my typical thing, but get some of this junk. Uh, we have conflict. And they delete them quick. Oop. Keep forgetting. Yeah, there we go. That was mine. Oh, doing next to no damage. But there we go. We did it. Gimme. Oh, we also have to scrap the guns that we have. Although I might save that because the scoreboard challenges for tomorrow might be uh, better than today. Hmm. Uh. Oh, they're just eyes? Let's go. Simple, simple, simple. There we go. We got one cap. I read cap and I was like, are they saying I'm lying? I don't understand. <laughs> hey, you. Quit sucking. There we go. Yeah, and we leveled up. Oh, hey. This is not about you. <laughs> Dude, you 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 could have survived. Hunting is another thing I was thinking maybe we could do uh here. Uh that's something that I like to do from here and there. Guys, I need to wipe my nose. You got to give me a second. I'm sorry for for doing that in front of you by the way. Um it's just Hey. We have a person with us. Um, let's... Let's wave. Oh, and they're my level. This is so interesting. Typically, I'm not the biggest fan of running into people because I'm like, you're stealing my XP. But, you know, it's just happy. It's exciting to, to see somebody out in the wasteland who's especially, like, close to my level, you know? And now we're homies. Get over here. Hmm. Very cool. It's so it, uh, it that that kind of stuff is so fun in these kind of games. Again, I was very apprehensive about games like this, uh, online games like this. Uh, I'm not the biggest fan of games like that. You know, online always, uh, or even just multiplayer in general. Not 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 my biggest fan. Like I'm not a big fan of that stuff. But you know, Fall 76 really did kind of introduce me to it in a way that I liked, and I do like running into people. Okay. Flamingo. Look at them. They're everywhere. Are you dead? Die. Although, I'm curious how the uh, uh, friendly fire works, because I know you can do PvP, but I hope it doesn't take, you know, us accidentally firing at each other as a... Yeah. Yeah, let's go. Can I dance? I want to dance. Yeah, we'll just give hearts instead. Hey, and we unlocked the first... Oh, whoa! And we have a 700... A level 700 member right here. Level 629 and a level 15. Let's go. That's awesome. And we did it. Not only did we get some score for this episode, but we also completed uh the first oh we also uh you know a uh, uh, claim to workbench i'm just gonna wave oh and they disappeared they did not like me waving maybe their work here was done i think they did emote at me and i just didn't see it earlier ah <sighs> that now that is a satisfying conclusion 
Um, yeah, I don't know if I want to um, necessarily uh, scrap my guns right now. Um, especially, like, I don't seem to be having weight problems. So. Um, we will eat, though. It's time for a meal. Hey, stop. <laughs> keep. I keep forgetting what the, the things are. Uh, we have mole rat chunks. Yum, 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 yum. And we... Not purified water. Do we have anything else to drink? Corn soup? Give us some liquid? Nice. Well, we did it, everybody. Uh, let's take a look at our other challenges before we go for today. We have three out of four, and we have 21 minutes. Collect 100 caps. I don't think I'm going to be able to do that. I don't think we're going to be able to do it, but you know what? Let's let's try at the very least to um to get some mole miners in. Not necessarily the easiest to kill, but uh first of all, let's claim this. Very proud to be claiming our red rocket visionary icon and we are going to go This is such a weird system by the way to have to go to the shop to apply your icon, but we're going to do it anyway and we're going to apply that. You know, we just earned it for free. And we're going to wear it immediately. Got some gum for free. And then... Icons. Uh, ah, from the previous season. Which one do I like better? It doesn't matter. We're going we're gonna to wear the... We're going to wrap the new season. That is what we are doing here today. Um... Yeah, and let's just, you know what, let's teleport back, because now we can, we can teleport back and forth. Let's go back, kill some mole miners, and then hopefully we will have enough, you know, time to complete. Please excuse my dear Aunt Sally, as you all know. Um, <laughs> Alright, uh, let us use our handy dandy binoculars. This is not... It might be. I don't know. We don't want to go here. We don't want to go there. Oh, here we go. This is where we want to be. All right. So let's... Let us descend. It's so funny because, you know, I can figure out where they are without those, but I don't know. There's a role-playing element. I feel like that that was a very handy use of the binoculars. The binoculars, you know? I feel like in that situation, it actually... You could argue that maybe I needed them as a player we didn't we didn't play a mission today though we didn't um you know locate the overseer's um transmission but that's okay you know we'll do that in the future and if anything we'll just go to the top of the world um i'm just worried about like there are some giant mosquitoes there that are super uh difficult uh for me a lot of the mosquitoes in this game are difficult and one of the first times i went into that area i had quite the difficulty Ooh. Oh, that means there are super mutants nearby. Let's see if we can uh, avoid them. Because we don't want to fight super mutants right now. We are only in the... Sounds like somebody got into a fight. We only want to fight mole miners. Who is shooting that much? I thought that was like slime. We might be headed in the wrong direction. Ooh. Some dogs. Oh no, those are those are raccoons. Friendlies. Ah, there we go. We we passed it, that's why. Can we Skyrim our way up? Ugh, darn it. We went too far down the meme hole. Oh, there are people attacking our uh, our base. Well, we're not here to defend it. If you want to attack it, go right ahead. All right, let's see what we can do here. What is this sound? All right, everybody. 
Full disclosure. Oh, they look dead already. Did somebody come through and kill these mole miners? That sucks. Full disclosure, uh, if there are mole miners here, I might die. Because I suck. We, we, we all suck right now. I think I can trigger a combat scenario, though. Yep, they're all dead. Darn it. Ginger snaps. I'm sure we could look around and still find people, you know what I mean? But I, I just don't think it's going to happen today. Oh, sorry. Yeah, they were taken out. Somebody's been here. That would explain that sound, too. It's like somebody was here doing something. I can't remember what, but there's, like, something to, like, spawn a bunch of mole men here. And unfortunately, I don't think we're going to be able to do that. But, hey, we have a lot to be proud of today. We, um... Ooh. Ooh. Very nice. And we get a fire breather's letter? Let's read it. As I'm called to duty, Lord, to fight the flames this world ignites, I ask you for your clarity, courage, and strength to fight this good fight. And if it is your will, Father, that among the flames I fall, please allow my soul to find peace, knowing I did my best to help them all. A little rhyme. Medex, pre-war money, sure. Give it to us all, why don't you? Uh, next, here, here's one thing for sure. Uh, we're going to spawn here next time we play. Um, and it's going to be full of mole miners. Um, I wonder if there's anything else we can loot while we're here. Whatever, let's just take whatever. Take this. We just need it for um, scrap, you know? And again, a common score quest thing is um, scrapping guns. So I, I, I kind of want to wait to scrap the guns that we have um, until... Ooh, here we go. Um, you know, again, I know a lot of people accuse this game of being boring. And I, I don't know. I think it's just a different pace. And I like that. I like its pace. It kind of reminds me of a point-and-click adventure only in 3D. Like, finding those little notes is so simple and so clean. <laughs> um, no, it's so simple and so, you know, innocent. It, it's just, like, it really makes me feel immersed, like, finding little notes that don't necessarily, like, that wasn't an important note to read, right? It wasn't like, ah, now this tells me about the greater story. It's just kind of like somebody's life, you know? Somebody's weird life before they, uh, you know, passed away due to the bombs. Give me it all. I'm greedy. Give me all the stuff. Oh, there's more stuff in here. All right, everybody. Uh, that's gonna do it for this video, you know? Um... Is there anything over here? No, I think that's going to do it for this video. Uh, let's pose right here. And we are going to end it. I don't know why photo modes do this. Avengers photo mode does the same thing, where it's like, your character still moves when you're using the analog stick. I don't know what's up with that. Um, I guess we'll take a photo. Anyway, everybody, I want to thank you so much for watching. If for some reason you enjoyed this video, don't forget to give it a like and to subscribe to my channel for more. If you stumbled on this thinking it was a main channel video for me, it's not. It's actually my second channel, Raw Carrot Scraps, where I upload more unedited, more unscripted Let's Play style content. If you want my more scripted and uh, edited and, you know, written stuff, uh, check out my main channel, which is Carrot Scraps. I post reviews, I post essays, thought videos, uh, rankings. I, I posted a tier ranking uh, uh, the other day. Um, and if you want to watch me play video games live, you can check me out on Twitch at twitch.tv slash Carrot Scraps. So I want to thank you all again so much for watching. And I'll see you soon.